Hello everybody, Croft Studios here, and I'm here with a LEGO Halo Mach number 2. And, um, yeah, it's basically what it is. It's Halo Mach number 2, and, um, I'm sorry I haven't made one of these in a while. I think the last time I made one was last year. I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm not done doing Halo. Um, it's just gonna be a little slower production, but I did make this small one a while ago, and I just haven't filmed it yet. And I'm gonna try and make another one soon, so I'm gonna try and continue this series. Um, hopefully it gets more popular, so... Let's go ahead and take an in-depth look at this mock. Alright guys, so we're going to start off where the Spartans are. And um, you've got this red one over here with an assault rifle. You can see him right there. And um, you can see his head, just a little clone trooper. And then you got a green one right here running away from the brute chopper that's coming in. And you got another one right here that's hiding behind this small barricade. You can see him right there. Um, this wasn't really that hard to build. It literally took me, I think, 20 minutes. I just really wanted to uh, make something Halo. And you can see it right here. It looks pretty cool. Um, I tried to make it look like basically destroyed. So let's go ahead and take a look at the next part. All right, guys, so here's the middle of the mock right here. And you got another Spartan right here that is gray. And he has two Magnums. Um, and he's dual wielding them, which looks really cool. And you've got some Brutes right here. Um, I don't know if I consider these Brutes, but I... I like using them as brutes because they're really big and tough looking. And you could use them as elites too, like this silver one that I'm using as an elite because he has the sword. Um, and then you can see just some little storage things or energy generator type of things. But it's just a really old looking battlescape looking place. So let's go ahead and turn this around. Alright guys, so on this side, um, on the opposite side, there's, not, there's basically this brute uh, chopper driving in with a brute on top. So I'm going to take this off. It's just sitting on here by this little stud. And you can see I've got most of the details and stuff that's that's on a normal brute chopper. You can see all the nice details I put in there. I've, and you've got the big wheel in the middle. You've got the small guns on the sides. Um, and the details and stuff on it. And then you got the little hover thing in the back because it does uh, drive like this, of course, in the game. And just got the little transparent piece to make the effect that it's in the air. Um, so, I think I did a pretty good job on it, so we're going to go ahead and, uh, take a look at the next part. Alright, so right here is basically like a crashed building. Uh, you can see how I hooked it on here, and it's just sort of wrecked and falling over and stuff. Just a little wrecked area. And then this is, uh, how the Brute Chopper got in the air. It drove up like this, and then drove, and then I had it on that little clear piece. You could see it would have driven up here, and then just flew flown off. Then you've got a brute uh, in the back here with a clear needler and you've got another one over there with a needler. So we're going to go ahead and take a look at the next part. And also at the back here you do have some nice details in the brute right there. And then you can see that. Not really much on the inside, just some small fallen roof. So we're going to go ahead and take a look at the roof of this really wrecked building. Alright guys, so up here you have a Spartan that's uh, hiding up here away from the brutes and he's sniping. Basically, what's supposed to be over here, which is the Brute Chopper, put that right there. He's trying to snipe him um, off of this. And then, he's very cool looking. Um, you can see it's just hooked down there by the clip. You can see that. Very cool. I like the gold visor on him. And you can see the roof's very busted up and stuff. It's very fragile. And then you've got a little chain right there in which he climbed up uh, to get on top. So I think it looks really cool up here. That's probably my favorite part of the mock besides the Brute Chopper. But it looks really cool when he's on top of it. And it um, so yeah, let's go on to the ending of this video. Alright guys, so that's basically it for the mock. Um, it's sort of a lame mock, not really much to it. Um, I mean, it didn't take that long. I just really wanted to get a Halo mock out. And I mean, it's been a really long time since I posted the last one. And I know you, um, some of you Halo fans out there like seeing my old Halo, Halo creations and stuff. And I do have an updated Scorpion tank, um, which I will definitely be sh showing soon, no doubt. That is, like, I've completely redone it, and it looks, like, ten times better, so I'll have to show you guys that. And I think I showed it at Brick Fair, too, so, um, you guys can get a sneak preview at that. I show my display at Brick Fair a lot. So, um, yeah, that's basically it. I hope you've enjoyed this Halo Mock video. Make sure to rate, comment, and subscribe.